Hi, Hiram here. I had a need for a short burner for a dry baking project that I have going. I needed something that was short and line fed. I was going to make something, maybe a wick stove or something. But I saw this on eBay and I thought I'd give this a try. This is called the Hockey Puck Stove, although it's actually only a burner. But it's called the Hockey Puck Stove, put out by Stove Daddy Stoves. It's a short um, carbon felt burner with a line feed on it for a cap, and it has a cap at the end. Came with a little two ounce bottle. I have methanol in this, so let me just thread this on. Now the idea is I needed something short and uh, something that I could regulate as far as size. So this kind of looks like it might be what I need. So all you do is you just feed the methanol in until the carbon felt here. Whoa. Hmm. Something's leaking here big time. Let me break here and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Sorry about that. The uh, bottle really leaks. I'm going to have to do something, get a different gasket on that or something. Anyway, you fill up this hockey puck burner until the carbon felt is shiny. Let's see what this looks like. Now this is a nice wide burn. Once it gets going, there is this uh, washer that they made that goes on the top to make the flame a little bit smaller. This is what I'm looking for. Okay, see how it cuts that down? Still hot. Okay, so what I'm going to do now is do a quick boil test just to see what this flame works like. So let me get my water prepped and I'll be right back for the test. Okay, I've got my water prepped. Let me light this. Okay. Now this hockey puck, even though it's called a stove, in my mind it's only a burner. So you have to supply your own pot stand. And in this case I'm using a hardware cloth wire stand. I have two cups of water right now sitting at 59 degrees okay now a couple of things with this I think I'm gonna have to change this this bottle just leaks I don't know I'm not real confident in that so I think I'm gonna change that out but let's do this boil test here and see where it goes here we have 210 211 Come on. 212 and 5 minutes 40 seconds. Okay, not bad. Not the fastest, but not bad. What I am looking for though is uh, a burner that's not terribly fast. Because uh, I have this idea for a. Uh, let me get this off. I have an idea for a dry baking system, but I needed a small flame. The Trangia just didn't work in it too well. So this is the, what, Stove Daddy Stoves, you can find them on eBay, calls his hockey puck stove, but I call it a hockey puck burner. Didn't work too bad. Now this is the full speed as the alcohol starts to run out here you just squish a little extra in okay it also comes with a simmering uh, the web the carbon felt on this kind of sticks up in the middle so it gives like a little little bump there when you put this on it actually sticks out past it so it gives you a small flame for simmer 
It also has, I guess what it calls a snuffer here. Just put it on like that and it snuffs out the flame. Okay, so that's the hockey puck stove burner from Stove Daddy Stoves. Two cups of water starting at 59 degrees. Room temperature is 56, humidity is 56%. Came to a full boil in 5 minutes and 40 seconds. Uh, the only problem that I had with this is that you have to be really, really, really careful with squeezing this bottle. The alcohol just came gushing out and it was, it was sealed. I don't know why it leaked, but I think I may change that for another bottle. Okay, so I thank you for watching. I look forward to your input, questions, remarks, helpful suggestions. And as always, watch for my holiday buddy, Maxwell. Bye now.